Hey guys, Chameleon.com here. Today we're going to be doing an overview for thermal printers, inkjet printers. Which one's right for you? And why I recommend the QL series by Brother. You can do a lot of different stuff with thermal printers. Before I go too far into this, there's going to be Amazon links and an eBay link, as well as a Chameleon link for computer stuff in the description below to help you get the best price for your next printer. With that said, let's delve straight into this and let's get started. So... This printer, it helps you stay organized, save time, it's easy to use, you can create labels for a lot of different stuff, uh, shipping labels, folders, envelopes, CDs, DVDs, labeling purposes, all sorts of stuff like that. Um, there's a lot of different types of tape you can buy, different widths, so it's pretty versatile in what it can do, but um, see what I'm saying, like you can get, you know, CD shaped stuff, you can get address labels done. Pretty, pretty self-explaining on that, but let me show you the screen really quick. When I typed in Brother QL570, the QL800 actually is the, uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Newer model for this, and it's an Amazon choice, so Brother is obviously making some good printers, good enough to get into our offices. And when I type in thermal printer, just in general, the Amazon choice is this $174 Rolo, but once again, guys, the QL thermal printer is only 80 bucks. So if you're just doing like small labels, could save you a few bucks. Um, other than that, I do want to show you this to you guys. Here's all the computer stuff at chameleon.com, by the way. We like mouses, headsets, tools, cables, ton of different stuff. But I really want to read this off to you just in case you're about to buy an inkjet or a thermal printer. So what's, I'm just going to cut to this. What's the advantage of an inkjet printer? There are many reasons a company might opt for an inkjet printer over a thermal. Here are some common benefits and advantages to choosing an inkjet. Cost. Inkjet printers, cartridges, and supplies are more widely available and therefore cheaper than their thermal counterparts. Image quality, even low end inkjet printers can produce nearly photo quality images. I can attest to that. Uh, Paper helps, though, if you have, like, glossy paper, but that's true to any printer. What are disadvantages of any of an inkjet printer? Inkjet printers are with, aren't without drawbacks and disadvantages. Here are a few. Image durability. Ink-based images may smudge, stain, and run when exposed to moisture, sunlight, humidity, and routine use. Not usually. Moving parts. Inkjet printers typically use more moving parts than thermal printers, increasing the chance of breakdowns that require repair or replacement. Probably just going to buy a new one. Reliability. Stickers, signs, labels, and other printed material may tear and peel too often for reliable long-term use. Hear that? Stickers, signs, labels, and other printed material. Yeah, maybe. What is a thermal printer? Unlike inkjet printers, thermal printers don't spray liquid ink through a nozzle to produce images. Rather, thermal printers use timely heating elements to activate or transfer pigments. Thermal printers are used commonly to create labels, safety signs, Wayfinding, let me zoom in a little bit for you guys. Wayfinding markers, barcode, shipping labels, and other heavily used items. How do thermal printers work? There are two distinct categories of thermal printers, direct thermal printers and thermal transfer printers. Here are a quick breakdown of how each works. Direct thermal printers use chemically treated paper that darkens when heated by a thermal printhead. A thermal printhead. Direct thermal printers do not use separate ink, toner, or ribbon supplies. Direct thermal printers are more commonly used to print items such as receipts and shipping labels. So that's part of the reason people use these for shipping labels. You don't have to. I don't think for a direct thermal printer, printer, you'd have to even fill them with ink. I think it's just always on the printhead. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. Thermal transfer printers use thermal printhead. Use a thermal printer. Why am I missing the A? To transfer a solid ink from a ribbon onto a label supply, usually made from vinyl, polyester, nylon, or other thicker materials, to produce a permanent print. Ribbon is usually made from wax, resin, or a combination of the two, and is bonded to the label surface with heat and pressure. So I'm guessing direct is probably less maintenance. What are the advantages of a thermal printer? There are several reasons to consider a, therm a thermal printer for your facility. Here are a few advantages of investing in a thermal printer. It's durable. Labels and signs created with thermal printers last longer and stand up to a wider variety of weather conditions than those printed with ink. 
They're versatile. Thermal printers can print documents, labels, signs that meet various needs, including durable arc flash labels, text and graphic-based floor marketing, and labels meant for extreme conditions such as cold storage. There's less maintenance. With fewer moving parts, thermal printers tend to last longer and are easier to, easier to maintain and run more reliably than an inkjet printer. I own an inkjet printer. Yeah, you got to clean them out sometimes, but I wouldn't say they're high maintenance if you get a good one, like a Canon or something. But hey, you know, we don't use thermal printers that much, but I can attest to them being awesome label printing machines. I mean, shipping label printing machines, label printing machines in general. For all those, for all that good, what comes with using thermal printers, they aren't without disadvantages and drawbacks. Here are a few complications that may arise from using thermal printers. Cost. This Specialty materials used in thermal printing process are considerably more expensive than their inkjet counterparts. Even the most basic thermal printer may cost hundreds of dollars. Well, I'm on Amazon, and I'm seeing 174. That's really not much more than an inkjet printer. Um, they might be talking commercial. Color choice. Thermal printers print a few colors and have high heat limits. Wax resin choices. See, that's the only thing. You're not giving you all the print crazy color stuff. This is strictly for labeling. So that's basically it. If you're looking for something with more colorful options, I would go with an inkjet. If you're looking for something more reliable, rugged, and you're just going to be printing labels on, I would go with the thermal. That's my two cents. That's Chameleon.com's two cents. And on that note, Chameleon.com is out. Be sure to check out... Uh, Thermal printers on Amazon or eBay today. Links in the description below. And be sure to check us out at chameleon.com because we have a plethora of stuff. Everything from computer gear all the way to maternity clothing. We're basically a little mini Amazon, so be sure to check us out as well. And also, subscribe, like, share, comment, questions in the feed below. I will get back to them as soon as we possibly can. Chameleon.com is out. Peace.